Here in New York, the judge in the civil fraud lawsuit against Donald Trump placed a gag order on the former president today. It followed a social media post showing a court clerk. Laura Jarrett has late details. Scam. Tonight, Donald Trump back in a Manhattan courtroom for the second day of the $250 million civil fraud lawsuit against him, revealing he plans to take the stand. Well, the appropriate time I will be. But it was his comments on social media that prompted a dramatic ruling from the judge after Mr. Trump posted a photo of the judge's law clerk posing with top Senate Democrat Chuck Schumer. The judge ordering the post on Truth Social removed, saying, personal attacks on any member of my court staff are unacceptable. Consider this a gag order. The Republican frontrunner again going after the Democratic attorney general who brought the lawsuit. Judge Engoran has been given false and extremely misleading information about my net worth. Private company, nobody's supposed to know my net worth. A net worth the state says was deliberately inflated to get more favorable loan rates from lenders. While Mr. Trump's legal team says real estate valuations are subjective. Attorney General Letitia James also in the courtroom once again. Her team calling Mr. Trump's longtime accountant to the witness stand. His firm preparing the disputed financial statements at the heart of the case. Forced to admit today that he learned the Trump organization didn't provide the firm with all of the necessary records. As for that gag order on Mr. Trump, the judge saying he's willing to impose sanctions if necessary, Lester. All right, Laura, thank you. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.